Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Dwyer in here. It is Friday, and that means it's another wonderful day for basics. You can see here that we are on Taijem on my lovely 3Q account, and I figure we will go ahead and stay on this today. Kind of hoping for black. I'd like to introduce uh, some frameworks that I haven't done yet into the series of basics. But you can't always control these things, so we'll play a couple of games, see what luck gives us, and where we go from there. Auto match start to. Having some strange luck here tonight. Just played someone that played 20 moves and then resigned. Beyond the point of it not counting. So that was a thing. Alright, we are in fact black. Awesome. I'm going to go into Kobayashi, I think, if I get a chance to today. Kobayashi is pretty straightforward. Not. Ooh, righty then. Well then, in that case, I'm just going to go ahead and enclose, like so. If you approach and they prevent you from doing something that you want to do, you can just go ahead and enclose and um, just play a territorial game, really. Uh, we're playing basic, so I will respond to this about it being a little bit too slow. Do I have to respond to that? Alright, so I'm going to come out first. That strengthens me as much as I need to be strengthened. He's approaching my corner. He owes me moves here, here, and here. So, okay, you know what I'm even going to do? I'm even going to... I lied. No, I'm not. I'm taking the 3-3. Three, three. I don't feel like I'm extending off of this. I'm going to follow the thing that he didn't respond to last, which is that. So I'll take, take the corner like so. Um, and then actually, I, I could do this, but I won't. I'm going to just calmly, since he built a wall to nowhere, I'm going to block that from ever being a thing. Like so. And we've now uh, obtained the... Uh... Whoa! Alright, I'm going to play Honest. You can do whatever you do, buddy. I'm going to pack my shit. And I think the opening has gone to us because we have... Nice! I'm going to poke it here just because. Now, the thing is, it's kind of hard to see here, but there is a double Hane here. So I'm going to make this exchange. Double Hane leads into a Ko for life in your corner after your opponent has this. So we're just going to be very, very careful. Um, I'm going to aid my last stone that I played. Okay. Like I said, we're just aiding our stone. We're not trying to kill anything. You know the score by now. We don't try to kill the basic series. Um... There's some Aji in my corner now that we've gone ahead and uh, been surrounded. So I'm going to defend. That way I've got some good shapes. And I don't want to be capped still, so I will jump out one more time. To be honest, I feel like I'm still vulnerable here. That's a weird feeling. Why, why do I feel that way? Uh, I feel like I'm this corner is vulnerable still. So I don't think I actually defended. Okay, okay, okay. I'll tell you what, I'll I'll play an extra move here. Is there actually a thing back there? Am I loose? Am I like being paranoid? I don't know. There there might have been a thing back there. We're not gonna we're not gonna care. Uh, I've invested this many stones to defend my group. So I'm just gonna go ahead and poke here real quick just for giggles. Uh, well, I'm contemplating where to play. It looks like it's either going to be this or this. I think this is the easiest one to go after. So, tell you what we're going to do. I will go ahead and pincer. This will be a game of very little territory, it looks like, considering he hasn't really made any with his stones, which uh, tends to happen when you don't really develop anything. Atari, eh? I could Atari here, and then, like, if he plays, I connect, and then these are dead. But I'll tell you what I'll do instead. We're not trying to kill stones. So I'm going to Atari in the kind of like the wrong thought a little bit, and just get strength on the outside. 
He'll get to live. I'm just going to make sure that I'm nice and stironk. Kind of like that. Okay, that's a force we move to. Otherwise, I get to go ahead and kill this, like so. Excellent, excellent. And now, I think I'm going to cap him here and grow a bit. Huh? I'm not sure why he's doing this. Like, I've got good shape here, right? Alright, I'm being very careful. Make sure this does not go anywhere. Because he's clearly trying to attack my stone somehow. I don't know how, but he's trying to do it. So I'm going to defend here. This stone is capped. I don't understand what he's doing. I'm going to extend so there's no Hane crosscut shenaniganry happening here. I think those stones are pretty dead. Okay. Uh, I will play the corner defense because I want him to have Sente and do something in here. <clears throat> Judging from the speed of this game, we are going to be on deck with at least two games tonight. Um, I'm going to first see about making sure that we've got shape here with our weakest group. This is This is our weakest group, mind you. So we're just going to go ahead and connect our weakest groups on up. And killing his cutting stones that he doesn't defend, apparently. That's something else we will do. It's all a question of what's the next important thing on the board. So those stones are clearly dead. At that cut didn't... I don't know what to play now. I mean, whatever I'll play here, because he's going to try something weird. This is fine. He'll probably play... no. Cut doesn't work because we're defended with it. Uh, extend. Atari. 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 And connect. This one can get out here. All we need is liberties here, which is why we were fairly confident that that's all we really needed to do. I mean, how many liberties does this group even have? Do you even know? Can you count them? One, two, three, four, or one, Two, three, four. Freeze account. Atari. Go ahead and take that to make sure this is dead. This doesn't really matter. All we need to do now is kind of sort of live back here. Just looking for a base, just looking for a base, just looking for a base, just looking for a base. We can give up the stones that don't have anything to do with the fact that we're looking for a base. As long as we do that, we should be pretty good. Confirmed life. Excellent. We cannot go to co on this one. I there, I here. So he was worried about like the Atari and the Atari. We were just worried about making sure that we had a uh, life with our group. And as long as we did that, we were happy. Mm -hmm. 
technically not a good move because I can like go there and Atari and stuff, but that's okay. Um, also, I think this is uh, not the largest move on the board. I think this move is the largest move on the board because... Ooh, someone's getting a little bit feisty, wanting to counterattack my base. Uh, looks like this is a lie with a connection, so I can go and play the move I wanted to play. Keep in mind, this is okay because we're just going to go back and kill this group and we're going to be fine. Right? Connecting up, don't mind me. I didn't read any of this out. Does this actually work? Yeah, we're fine. Alright, so I didn't actually read any of that out before I played it. That could have been bad. Whoa, man. <laughs> Dude. One, two, three, four, five liberties to four. So this actually works quite, quite well, to be honest. Can Hane, it's fine. If he goes here, a little less fine. But it's okay, we just play here. Or even connect, really. Uh huh, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and connect like so. Because this is... He can't block, otherwise he's dead. He, he lost a little bit there. He lost a little bit at the end. A little uh, too fast. A little too fast. Yeah, because see here... Like, this is kind of like handicap kind of go, you know? Like, he's not finishing his base, he's kind of trying to put pressure on my corner. The pressure he's trying to put on my corner can't get a base either, so if it all runs, he's got two groups. Uh, what move is this number? What move number are we on? Um, not very many. But we just took Tente. Took his corner, he blocked the wrong direction, unfortunately, so we just go ahead and make sure he can't really develop from it. He hyperextends here, which leaves weaknesses in the 3-3 in the approach, as well as here. This doesn't really do much of anything. I think he thinks that maybe this gives him territory. Maybe there are some uh, three cues out there that only ever go like, all right, well, I'm going to do this. And then they just get give the fourth line territory away, but that's not what we were going to do there. Just a peep. Defense, don't even try to counterattack it, just get safety, get safety, get safety, and then counterattack like so. He didn't get a base, so he's going pincer. Let him get a base now, he should have been uh, taken there, that would be a lot easier. And then this again was very odd, like that was okay, but then why continue? Like, where is this going? I don't really know. Here, the group here is strong. This one is not, so we're not going to, like, work against the stone. We're just going to get shape. Attack the cutting stones that are not uh, defended. And, you know, since he didn't defend those, those kind of just died. And that was pretty much the end of the game. Yeah, that's pretty much the end of that. Let's play it again. Let's play another game. There we go. Game is started. 1033, we are white. Give him a hello. Nice to meet you as well. Because he's being all polite. 
Hit up a 3-4 stone. Because he has dual 4-4s. Four Approaching on the inside. I'll back off see what he wants to do with that one. Playing normally. Take my enclosure. He'll block my extension. Uh... I'll take my extension. I value mine over his. Ooh, double enclosures. I will split this absolutely. All right, he's pincering me now. Means my stone's in trouble. Since my one stone is in trouble, I will jump to defend it. Looks like we're in pretty good shape here. I could play this one, but I won't. I'll just do a one-point jump again. Um... I should really cap the group he didn't respond to. But let's get a defensive move here first. Let's get ourselves a base. Let's not go crazy. All right. We are now completely settled here. For the most part. Left some Aji. That is insane, but okay. We're going to go ahead and cap. He's got, he's got his corner, let me tell you. Now, I'm just going to do something a little silly and make myself some shape here. Because, again, we're not trying to kill him. We're not trying to kill him. All we're trying to do here, really, is just make shape. That's what we do here, right? That's what we do here. Next largest area is looks like it's going to be over here, so I'll play it. This is a pretty wide open area. Nothing else really seems to be. He's playing connection, so I will lean on this to grow the area that uh... Huh. Just to grow the area in general. He's going to my corner. I value that as not being valuable. So I'm going to keep building my middle because we're entering the middle now, not the corner so much. So I'm going to keep building up my middle. And if he wants the corner, he can have it. Don't cut me. I'm going to double Hane for maximum aggression because I'm really strong in the middle. That for, Therefore, I can kind of get away with little things like this, you know? And I'm just gonna go ahead and eyeball some kind of some kind of thing like that, I guess, to try to build up center. I'm gonna attach to it to see if I can keep it from going into my middle. I could cut that off if I wanted to. I won't. Uh oh, we got a we got a live one on our hands. He's trying to live in my area. He's of course allowed to. I mean, I can't stop him. But he does need this thing called a base. Like, I have taken no aggressive actions against him so far. Okay. You descend first, because it's starting a connection. Then you turn. Unless he plays the Hane, then I Hane back, because again, it threatens to cut through. And then I'll go back and turn. This is a little bit bad. I'm kind of a little bit fearful that my opponent is about to kill himself. 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 liberties. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 liberties. Okay. Just double count just to make certain that you're reading things correctly. That's all. Here's a moment of truth. Do we kill this? That's Gote, you see. Because if he pushes up, I block. If he goes here, I push through. If I play here, he's dead. He can't live local. Basics games. Basics games is the death of you, man. I'll defend. Look at my fourth nine territory. Ain't she amazing? <laughs> ay ay ay. Oh god, I think it's still kill him. Play here and you're fine. Uh, Kiseki, but that's fine. Um, so, rats. We couldn't kill him in the middle. What do we do? Is a game a bust? We played a game where we had to kill, we couldn't kill. Oh my god, game over, right? Not really. We have some influence. Let's just see what we can do with it. No need to, uh, you know, wave the white flag just yet. Let's let's see where we go, what we can do. He gave us Sente again. He didn't have to. He didn't have to. He plays there. I'm just going to play there. And if I play here, he plays... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I need to give him Sente. Your move. I'm not building a huge middle because he missed a life and death problem. Mm -hmm -hmm. That's more reasonable. That's more reasonable. Mm -hmm. Let me show you a trick here. Ain't that sneaky? Because now he can't go here. Because it cut here and there's a ladder there. Ain't that sneaky? There are whole, there's like a hundred different reasons why. The double large knight just isn't a thing. And that's a good example as to why. You see how he's getting like reduced here? I can make a little bit of territory here, it looks like. A very, very little amount. Very little amount. But it's, you know, better than nothing, right? Alright, this is live. He plays here, he plays here. Okay. Uh, that should do her. See, got an eye there, and like an eye here. <sighs> My brain turned off for a second. And I'm like, ah, why is why is he cutting off my group? Stupid. And I was like about to Atari him. Oh god. Roger that. Roger that. That uh, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Oh boy. <laughs> Gives you a bit of a rush though, because like you came like this close to being horribly dead. Oops, KJS notification. Um, so I want to reduce this corner while I can, because it's like this is his territory, like this is his territory. Uh, I think we got a little bit of things we can do here to be perfectly Ernesto. Is it basic though to live back in the corner? It's a good question. I think so. The clamp is pretty friggin' basic. Not gonna lie. I've got a pretty big decision to make on my hands.
This is a really big decision. I hope he doesn't try and Hane here. He might be okay to Hane. He might be okay. Yeah, yeah. Here and then here, and we're good, right? So we're alive. If he does anything back here, we ignore him. Tell you what, no, we can play here still. So. No reason to go up our stones. Because this is like this is this is life. If we place here, this is life too. So that's fine. I don't do anything tricky. I mean, you could play here. We just play here. He goes underneath. You go there. Then if he actually does take you, Tari, and then Atari, and then he's so dead. Uh, if he goes on the other side, you uh, cry. No, you extend back, and then he can't throw in. Otherwise, you play here, and you can't do that without Atari again. So the downside about what he's doing right here is he's got to be careful. If this is ever an Atari, if this is ever an Atari, then I cut here and the whole thing dies. I won't do it, but it's just, it's, you know, it's there. Something to think about. He plays there, I connect. He plays there, I connect again. Let's go ahead and play this. Again, that's life. So I have Mii, and then we're just going to play here. Because this is, um... Sente. Confused. I mean, I got two liberties. And stones in Atari. So he plays here, I just play here. It's kind of strange. A little weird. A little weird. Corner didn't have to turn into this kind of thing. Uh, when I clamped, he should have just clamped and then prevented me from reducing him any further. This is a uh, textbook bad idea. He went all in to try to kill everything in the center, or and everything in the corner, rather. But there was no reason to really do that, you know? There was no reason to try to kill every bloody thing in the corner. I That's just mm, weird. I'll go ahead and defend. Unfortunately, because he did that, the game's really, really over now. Protect our cutting point here. One stone doesn't matter. I'm... I don't know if this is a good idea. I'll play it so we can't like push and cut and do weird things. Be like weird and creepy. So we have territory, whoops, uh, down here, which is excellent. He has territory, which is here, which is not excellent. Uh, here, which is mildly okay. Uh, here, which is decent. His territory there is decent. Put up a few points in the middle. It's not bad. I didn't really need to do that much damage to it, though. I thought he would just, like... You know, defend against the clamp. You know? It's very strange. It's very strange. I could not predict his push. I don't know. 
guess I'll just take some more territory. Rusus is mostly just Dame, so I'm a little confuzzled. Okay. Right. Um, Gim Sente? I don't know what to do. Is this a big end game? Probably not. All right, so this game is pretty much over now. I mean, you can count his territory uh, without too much trouble to be. Ooh, we go ahead and just defend. I'm going to capture that. Mm. All right, if I have to capture it. Might as well go for it. No, I don't. One eye versus no eye, stupid. You don't have to capture it. Oh my god, you suck at this game. Not him, me, by the way. Because I was like, oh, I'd have to capture it. Why would you have to? Because he has, an, he has liberties and I have an eye. How does that mean you have to capture it? Oh. Right. One eye beats. Got it. Makes sense, makes sense, makes sense. I do believe it makes sense. But yeah, the upper left-hand corner is about the strongest corner you could ever actually have in a friggin' game, let me tell ya. I'll give you that one. Uh, Cause I had like a small knight and a two one space extension on the other side. That's a lot of defense for the, the, the small knight enclosure. It's not optimal, it's not efficient in terms of getting territory, but you know, it's pretty strong really hard to um, actually like invade that kind of thing do 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 all right so one eye beats none on both sides so we're good um i'll play here reduce <clears throat> throw it in the cut I don't know what else to play, really. Um, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Owie. Owie. Stone's mine now. Though he has Sente. Mm -hmm. Not sure what else he's going to do now. We are in endgame, so he's got endgame against me on the left hand side of the board. A little bit of endgame against me on the upper right side of uh, the board. He's got. Um, a little bit of endgame on the bottom side of the board as well, yes. Gotta go make two eyes down there, kinda rough. Um... Maybe he's counting now? Something like that. We're almost up to one Q, by the way. I lied, so I have more games. What? I don't know why he did that. I mean, that's a cut. Maybe he feels like he's behind, so this has to not work for me, or, I mean, he's just going to keep falling behind, so he, like, 
He's drawing a line in the sand right here. It's like, I'm going to fight this. This isn't going to work. I'm going to kill you somehow. And if I'm wrong, then I'm just going to resign the game. That happens occasionally. Overtime countdown has begun. Overtime has begun. He changed his mind. Okay. Hmm. Kind of figured he would. Kind of figured he would. Ooh, we gotta be careful here, cause there's like show nagonary. Let's go ahead and defend. Make sure we're nice and completely secure. That's a poke. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, goats, okay. Um, looking at the sente. Can't play this because of this, so I'm gonna play here first. That way now I can. There's no reverse sente here for whatever. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, what else do we have? Nothing really. I mean, I just don't see a lot of places to go. End game setting in, which means I'm yawning. <laughs> That's so bad. But it's useless unless I can make an eye here. If I can't, then this is going to be awkward. I think we can. Oh my god, I didn't even notice her. Oh, no, not the push. Not the push, the Atari. Oh my god, right, 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 right. Good for you, good for you. Alright, you're right. You're right on that one. You got your three stones. Good job, good job, good job, good job. I think that's larger. I'm being careful now. I'm not playing a one point Gote sequence up here. That doesn't do anything. That actually just gave me a point. So the throw in here is useless. That gave me. I mean, it's not like that terrible, but there's just no point behind it. Only point would be behind it would be if there was like a cut point here, then all oh, right, then I couldn't do that because then that would be an Atari, right? Then it would have a point. Absolutely. Do you mind if I take that? Nope. Okay. Yeah, we're good here. Go take one point takeaway there. Rather take this one, though, to be honest. <clears throat> he's trying. He's thinking if he can play here. The answer is no. Really, the answer is yes. Are you sure? The answer actually could be yes. I'm gonna lose my eye over there. This is gonna get poked out. Alrighty there, sir. I'm with you. 
I'm with you, sir. I hear ya, sir. Take two point first. Do 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 do. Reread. Bop. Ignore. Bop. 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 Take. Bop. Yeah, we're good. Bop. Bop. Boop. Bop. Skeet. Plop. Bloop. Bloop. Really? Bop. 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 Take. Bop. 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 Take. Bop. 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 Take. Bop. Bop. Yeah, we're fine. I'll go and take this into this. I'm surprised he hasn't atari here yet, to be honest, because I don't really... Yeah, there you go. I wonder what the score is. Okay. That should be one point. Unless he really wants to go to Ko over this. He'd go bloop, bloop, and then blah, blah. But... That takes a one point uh, I into a potential two point Ko. Mm hmm. I don't want to play here because then those are things. Um, I'll play this one instead. I, I could play here and like, yeah, woohoo, but then like, yeah, oh, who, ha, hmm, don't like. So I'm just going to avoid those. I don't know why we're like playing over this. It's not that close of a game. Tell you what, you can you can have it. I'm 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 done. You're it's all you. There's no reason to fight the code because we're already ahead, so it's fine. You can fill. Alright, counting. And we win by 22 points. Not bad. Oh, righty then. Nope, refuse game, sorry. So in this game, he approached the 4-4 instead of the 3-4 point, which is not very good. 3-4 has priority, so we got to enclose. Um, he should block my extension from my enclosure. Those are really, 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 really important. On opening theory, if enclosure, block extension, if extension, block enclosure. Nice, simple, easy, peasy. Said he has two large knights off four four points, which means the three three is vulnerable in both of them. But first we can just go ahead and play here. He pincered us instead without an ability to get a wa uh, base, so I'm fine jumping. If I was being particularly aggressive, I could play here because I can see really quickly that... Uh, not really frightening here, is it? This is a cap on the left-hand stone, so what does he answer this? If so, then that's a dead shape. If he doesn't, I follow up. But we just jumped out instead. He did that, which was bizarre. Really trying to get us to respond. Unfortunately, now that we have Absente, we could go back here and live if we so felt inclined. Said he played here, I got the cap. Having a weaker thing you can attack is absolutely priceless. Like right now, for example, normally I would play here and then maybe he'd play something like this. And I don't know. I would just go for crazy amounts of influence because I'm leaning against a group. Like, 
pretty easy. That's okay though. This is this is this is variation variations okay. Too many Gote moves. It turns Gote. I mean, I like that he's not playing Puppy Go, but at the same time, some of these moves are kind of large. Yeah, like the stuff that I'm doing in the middle right now is worth way more than whatever else he thought he was doing. So in actual game, I wouldn't have played there. I would have turned up immediately and tried to kill this. Because he can't really do anything here. Not with that Atari in place still. And last but not least, if we had played here, that's his uh, that's his base. If he plays here, we play there. If he plays here, we play there. And he's dead. Then this we already looked at. We don't cut. We just go ahead and play this one. And that doesn't go anywhere either. We let it live though. Him playing that though was a mistake, cause like if I play here, he plays here. If I play here, he plays there, and then I can't play either of these. So he would have been fine there, unfortunately. And the follow up to this would have been the play here, cause this is kind of unfortunate. I get to like cap both areas. So that's big. That's big, being able to get all the stuff. Said he's, uh, he fought back a little bit, which is good. Did a little bit of reduction, which was good. Surrounded me, which was excellent. But yeah, this. Ay, 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 ay. Oh. This would be the easiest way to play once you get the most of your corner. You could also clamp on it immediately, that'd be okay. Um, maybe here, I don't know. I guess this would be okay too. Either way, you have a lot more corner here than just getting rid of, oh my god, yeah, this stuff. Yeah, that's just the end of the game right there. That's so huge. Lost the entire corner for very little in Gote. Too much, man. Too much. Just couldn't uh, come back in the game after that part. So that was just GG. Either way, hope you enjoyed today's basics games. I was kind of hoping for more of a Fuseki, maybe Kobayashi, or I don't know, Chinese or something. But we just didn't get a chance to do it because they never really seem to let you. Darn. Either way, I hope you enjoyed the games regardless. And as always, I'm Darren. This has been my basics video. And I will see you again next week. Take care, everybody.